Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlemagne's adventure in Factorio. This is our New World series, and here we're going to try and solve our problems. And I don't. I think now we're producing stuff because we have fuel, or fuel. <laughs> we have petroleum gas, uh, but we're going to burn through our crude a lot quicker. So. How are we going to avoid that, folks? Hmm. Good question. Well, we need to tap into some more resources. So let's take a look here. So we got, we're tapped into those, those, not sure, and, and those two, I think that's what that is, but there's more up there. So let's go up to that wall, extend the wall out, and yeah, so let's do that today. So do I have enough materials? Uh, turrets wall pieces we should be okay so let us go up there and take care of some business okay so looks like the one side is producing okay no okay so that's all right the one side and it is backing up so it's good 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 so let us do that Ooh, all those turrets up there engaged from somewhere probably oh we know we have to take care of those guys, all of those. <laughs> That's for sure. How many are in here? Nine more? Okay, so it's producing. That's good. So let's go up here. Do I have? I don't have any concrete. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll just tie in the oil into that system right there. So we should have oil right here somewhere. I think this is it. Okay. There should be three deposits here, or just the two. If we go map. Uh, Maybe just the two deposits beside each other. We'll know once we fix this wall here. So let's do this. We're going to build the wall from here, I think. Ah, come on. Really? Oh, yeah, the tree's going to be in the way. I knew the tree would be in the way. It'd be too easy. <laughs> so we'll build the wall. Perfect, okay. Let's chop this tree down here. Now we can replace this other wall here. Uh, it's going to take forever. Let's pick those up. Let's do this. Um, perfect. One, two, three. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah, I know. We're counting. Because this is how I do things. I like to them to be nice and symmetrical, and just I like it that way. <laughs> okay, so let's place this stuff in. Okay, perfect. This is the oil deposits right here, hey? So let's pick up this wall here, even though it's monotonous and boring. <clears throat> we definitely need to. So it's exciting. So we kind of extended this out. We, we're going to secure some more oil deposits here. Now off to the right here, you can tell there's a couple more right there. We'll have to tap into that as well. That's why I want to create engines. We'll have to look into making those today, potentially. And then I think we should go on a border patrol of our base. And you lay down some concrete and maybe you check the turrets. I just want to see what they're doing for ammo wise. They should be okay because the ammo should last a long time. I have a feeling it's only just small you know, amounts of creatures coming, but yeah, I don't know. And I do want to establish that the. Uh, we should put some turrets up here too on this side. Something like, like this. Two, three. So, what? One, two, three. One, two, three. And I want to pick the fish up. Okay, can we pick this fish up up here? Ah, too far. <laughs> okay, and the reason I'm putting these turrets here is because I have a feeling that base that's close by up here is going to invade at some point. Okay, so just two deposits here. That's okay. We have two derricks, so it's perfect. <clears throat> we need to bring power up here as well. So let's hook in the pipes we need more pipes uh, yeah we don't have enough supplies that's for sure yeah okay well 
Uh, gotta run down and grab some supplies. Maybe what we'll do is we'll grab, we'll check the fuel here. How's this going? Yeah, it's slowly being chewed up. Let's pick up a bunch of coal because I think we need to replace a lot of the burners, the fur, the fur, the, ah, the burners, the the furnaces. Okay, I got two balancers in place there. I didn't realize that. Okay, throw that in there. This way should be. Uh, we should see. This is why I want to put paths everywhere because then when you run along them, it's a lot faster. Oh, look at that! Those turrets that we just placed up there have engaged. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, petroleum, I think, is the issue. So we need, but it's not because there's lots in here. So we need ga uh, pumps, I think, to direct the the flow. Unless this is given priority over this one, all right, which makes sense and which that's the way I want. I want the, the research to be handled before this stuff, all right? So for example, if I was to start research, it would go like crazy. So we need the advanced oil processing so that we can create all this stuff. So we can crack the light oil into, yeah, so we can, yeah, so this is what we'll do. We're gonna do, gonna research advanced oil processing. Now this will all start to move here shortly. <laughs> Well, sort of. These batteries kind of go as well, hand in hand. Um, yeah, because we're going to have a lot of oil that we're going to have to deal with at some point. Um, so let's see here. So for engines, what do we need? Um, so we can make engines, and then we can probably... Okay, so yeah, yeah. Okay, so we need steel plates and gears and pipes. Steel plate, gears, and pipes. Here's pipes. Maybe what we can do... Steel plate, gears, and pipes. What happens if we do this? Steel plate, gears, and pipes. Well, we can... Okay. Steel plate, gears, pipes. So steel plate we'll have to bring in. Steel plate, yeah. Okay. So we'll bring in the steel plate down through here. So, which means we need to do something like this. Okay. We need to split it. And to put that in place there. Perfect. And we'll have to bring it underneath or force this to go underneath. Um. I think we can force it to go underneath. Okay, and do. We'll grab the steel plates off the 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 one line with the copper there. I think that will be f just fine and dandy. Okay, let's see here. Oh no, this is yeah. No, that's right. That's right. Steel plates down. This light's in the way. Uh, so where do we want to replace that light? Right here. Let's make a bunch more lights. 20. Half 30. Okay. Okay, so these are pipes. So what? So we can build it right here? Right like that. So we'll pull in stuff like that. Stuff like that. We don't need to double belt it. And we don't need anything spectacular. Maybe maybe we can increase how many pipes a little bit. We'll pick up some pipes as well so we can have some of that. Yeah, um, let's do like that. Okay, perfect. Now this would be engine units. Oh, we need gears though. Shit, that, that's not gonna work. Maybe not here. Gears. I'm just thinking kind of where I wanna put these. So maybe what we'll do is we'll keep a space like that. I can put gears in here, which will get taken up. Okay, this thing could go there. This can still make the engine. OK, 
Okay, this can still make the gears. And then we need this stuff. Man, those attacks are just relentless. Relentless, I tell you. They just get worse and worse. Huh. Shucks, hey? We need to... We need that solar power. <laughs> Advanced oil processing is done. That's what we need. Okay, is there anything more in those lines? What's this thing? Okay, combat shotgun. How about this? That's better armor. Effect transmission, basic beacon. I wonder what that is for. Not sure what that's for, unless that attracts the, the biters. Okay, we'll leave the research as it is, because we can burn through that, we know we can. So let's just continue this. We can make it have, continue, ah. we, we don't need to go crazy with the gears. I don't think so. Okay, so we'll grab the iron from here. Steal this stuff. Those biters are distracting me. Let's see. So if I bring the steel plate down like this. A tree's in the way now? Or, no, not yet. And I think like this. Then we can power it. Let's see. Oh, huh, like so. We can even put a light right there. And this will start to produce. Um, where do we want to put it? Let's put it right here for now. The reason I'm putting everything into boxes is because it's for the logistics system. I'm kind of thinking ahead a little bit. So if we have robots, they'll be able to pick, you know, drop off chests and all that stuff they can they can do. Um, we just need more power. Let's put power like what, like that. Okay, and that should... Okay, why is this not... There we go. Okay, perfect. Maybe we can turn this one like that. Okay, now it's making them perfect. So we also need to make these guys. So we need the lubricant. Where do we get lubricant from? I think lubricant is created from heavy oil. Okay. So let's check this cracking stuff. So lubricant we'll put over in here, uh, but this cracking, where is this cracking? Here is this cracking. Um, so if we change this cracking, this cracking, three, three, four, one, five. So what's the difference? Oh, I need to hook in water. Where do we pull water from? Where is the closest water source? Uh, okay, I understand now. I guess we could pipe the water in, so we'll just do the basic Okay, processing. I need to put lights down here. Uh, we need to make some more tanks, I guess. Well, maybe not. Um, so if we're going to do electric engines, we need electronic circuits and lubricant. Electronic circuits we can bring down somewhere somehow we'll just bring it down probably we'll split it here and bring it down through here and maybe so engines are right here so maybe we'll put it like this Let's see here if it bring it down like that put electric engines in here maybe okay and then we can unload these guys And what, bring them up on a belt? It's going to be kind of weird, but... Uh, how do you want these tanks to go? Maybe like that, and... Like that. Let's bring this up. Yeah, this would be alright. Because we don't need the one row of engines, alright? And this will continue to operate as it does. Maybe we'll make 
a little bit more than that, maybe that much. Because they take so long to build. Okay, lubricants. So we need lubricant, and then we'll need circuits. Not a problem. We'll just pick these up here. Like so. Perfect. Okay. Ah, um, oh shit. This splitter here. Can I do one more? Yeah, whatever, that's fine. Okay, so then now we can split the... Okay. So we need to... Something like this, I think. Okay, and then we can put the splitter here. Take those out. It looks kind of funny, but there's a reason to it. And then this stuff, maybe what we, actually what we can do, like this, and then we'll go underground. I guess I could have combined. No, no, I can't because we just need the steel. Okay, never mind. We'll just do it this way, quick and dirty, and that works. Okay, now lubricant. Well, where are we gonna store the lubricant? Maybe we can make the lubricant. Up here, one, two, three, four. We probably only need four tanks. Let's chop down these trees. We'll store the lubricant right in here, probably. And yeah, that way, then we can leave room down here for processing. I think that's what we shall do. So let's see here. Oh, I need to put the coal. Shoot. Okay, so good, still processing. We'll have to expand the processing. I don't think we're making enough. Ooh, just caught it right at the end. Ah, we're out already. Crap. <laughs> That's okay. Right here, pick up a bunch. Man. Okay, that should be enough, right? Let's start all over, make sure we've got all these up here. We have to check the, the iron deposit, because that might be running low at some points. Wow, look at all this coal. It's been a while since we've came to this. Now we're gonna run out, I think. Uh, oh, maybe not. Perfect, okay, good. Whew, I was worried there. Store the extra in here. That's pretty much filling up as well. We could probably take it from there the next time. Okay, so let's see here. So red circuits are kind of... So does that mean that this stuff will produce? That's still slow. Yeah, we need like pumps to kind of direct the flow. Yeah, the crude were pretty much screwed on the crude. Ah, uh, okay, anyways, lubricant, lubricant. That's what we're gonna build. So maybe we can build it close to that. Okay, and then we'll hook this in. It's two pipes, okay, so that's the lubricant. And then we can just dump these engines into a box like so. Uh, maybe we'll make the same amount. Uh, I think that's it. That, that meets the requirements. Now we just got to power it. Um, like that. That should give it power. Give it life. Put the light there. Okay, so now, let's. how do we create lubricants? We 
we need chemical factory chemical plant good we'll make that and then we'll call it an episode once we get this going and then we'll we'll deal with that we'll, we'll hook in those other oil deposits in here as well kind of in the next episode there at the beginning of the next one so we'll just get this this lubricant done maybe we'll just because we need heavy oil right which you can just grab from here pull it along maybe we'll just put this right here so that's where the pipe will be I think that will let's see where's the pipe so one so we'll have to snake it a bit and then bring it over here I think like that yeah I think like that let's let's check it out here so we got this pipe we'll put up here all right and I'll go over and up okay now we'll do underground pipe and uh, we'll just carry it through. I just got to chop some trees down here because they're getting in the way. Uh, this will make lubricant, which then we can just go doot doot. This needs power, of course it needs power. Okay, and now it's making it, so let us, let's just do a pipe, like so, and bang, okay, and up into here, now it's producing, okay, perfect, there we go, lubricant is in effect, does that mean we're out of power, oh, that's daytime, okay, cool. So, got that. So, that's going to use heavy oil, um, light oil. Okay. And we'll have to take care of the light oil some. I think light oil we can crack into petroleum so we can make a chemical plant for that here as well. This will be quick. We'll set it up right here, the cracking. And we can hook it right into the, the gas down here. So we'll do this. Maybe like this. I guess it doesn't matter. Do that. Turn it into petroleum. Because we need that more. Um... Okay, uh, we're going to need to bring in some water though, shoot. Shucks. That won't be fun, okay, so. Uh, water, maybe we'll bring in water like this. Oh, no, that won't work. Think, think, think. I'll do this and then we can go like this and then we can do this okay where is water now um, let's bring this pipe further chop this down okay Water, water, where are you? So we'll make a water pump. Hmm. Let's see, we need to make a water pump. Where are you, Mr. Mr. Water Pump? That's right here. Okay. Uh, we can put it there, but then we need to do something with these. Okay, and then we can 
lay this down. Perfect. Now let's put this down. Okay, and let's bring this downwards. Perfect. Ah, come on. Okay, uh, here we go. Yeah, well, trees will go down. That's that's progress, right? Uh, let's see here. Okay. Uh, oh, we went too far, I think. Bring this down here. Yeah, right here. Perfect. Okay, and do that. So water will be hooked in. Which means that we can move the water over for the advanced processing of this stuff as well if we'd, if we'd like. Uh, we can probably work on that eventually. Let's take that out. Take that out. Uh, right over here, we can take this one out. Okay. How about this stuff over here? Let's take a look at the copper reserves. Okay. Yeah, look at that. Crazy. Let's repair this. 92, 99. We're still good with ammo. Perfect. Okay. Ooh, look at that. Okay, so maybe what we need to do is just add piercing rounds to all of these here. Okay. Because we're going to make sure everything is kosher here on the front lines. Yeah, we're, we're using up our resources, that's for sure. Perfect. Okay, all these turrets are no longer necessary, which is good. So much faster on these, these paths. <laughs> uh, okay. We need some more ammo, of course. We want to continue this production. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, just grab it all. We'll need it all. Okay. Somehow I got a bunch of batteries, so we'll throw them all onto here. Like so. So they can be thrown on the belt. Maybe as I was picking up the stuff. Uh, engine units are being made. Perfect. So this is where we can make pumps. Excellent. So let's grab a few so that we can do that. Let's check on the accumulators here. Ooh, 48. So this is kind of what my plan is. I'll show you quickly here before we kind of get off. And four, five, perfect. I'll show you here what what I want to do with the the system, which is kind of exciting. It's going to help us power everything through the night. Let's see here. Yes, so we can continue with this pattern basically. And if I had robots. I can replace or rebuild this pattern as much as I would like, right? Two. So it's basically something like this. I think it's two units right in the middle. Yeah. Like that, right? And then we want to place these guys. Right? And then place this guy right in the middle. Bang. And we want to place these guys. And we're going to carry on. Re repeat and carry on with this pattern. And that's going to be our solar field. Hopefully it will be enough to reduce our pollution footprint. If pollution is from production, that's fine. Um, but when it's the... You know, those steam engines produce a lot, a lot of pollution. And so I think if we can avoid that... You're using those, then we should be okay. 
And that's what the plan of this is. I think this should be the most efficient power. Should be, I hope. <laughs> Just because I think it has the proper ratio. Um... Yeah, I just think it has a proper ratio. Um, I could be incorrect on that, and that's fine. I like the design of this one. I like how it looks. Um, you can't really make you know, your own designs like this. Someone already came up with this at some point and posted it on YouTube, of course, uh, just because it's, <laughs> it's the way it goes. You can only design things you so much, right? You can design any way you like. It just might not be s super efficient, right? And if that's of no concern, then you build it how you like, right? But I have limited resources, and with the resources that I have, this is kind of what I'm trying to do. Um, hopefully this will supplement enough to slow down the use of the coal. And yeah, that's kind of it's just the, the, the plan. So that way we can continue on with the research tree and get to building the cool stuff, right? Like the robots, and then finally the, you know, I wanna build some trains, we need to find some stone. Um, yeah, just stuff like that. And then we can you finally finish this campaign as well. <laughs> I don't have any more accumulators. So what are we now for capacity? Let's take a quick peek here. Oh, look at that, there's a chunk of coal here. Let's, let's harvest this. Let's just slap that into a box power that's crazy um so anyways so it looks like 285 megajoules i have no idea what that means no idea how long that will last but see this has already exceeded the production of steam engines and we're able to reduce the steam engines perfect well and that should reduce the pollution levels a little bit hopefully oh they're bleeding well, thank you everybody for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this episode, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye-bye.